Ben Purse recovered 14 years later. And look, it's almost like a snapshot in time. A pager, Nokia cell phone, even a film camera. Yes, film, all still inside that bag. As WBZ's Julie Lonchak reports, the victim was speechless when officers gave her a call. Of all the things Lisa Hall Mazaglia has lost and found over the years, this wasn't exactly atop the list of things she wanted back. It was kind of like being had delivered a small time capsule. In December of 2002, Lisa was a Boston news director, inspired by a story she saw about giving back. She paid it forward and purchased presents for needy children. But as she was loading them into her car, someone swiped her purse. You know, it dampened your Christmas spirit a little bit that you're trying to do something nice and something like that happened. Thankfully, this story doesn't end here. It just jumps a decade or so. I happen to open up this barrel and I see a purse that had been dusty for quite some amount of time. Bo Haynes found that bag while collecting trash at the Seabrook Market Basket with nearly everything still inside. I was stunned and 14 years later turned it into police and it's more than just a bag I mean you look at this and it takes you back to a whole different time in your life it definitely does <laughs> yes a time uh, before smartphones when you had to carry a, a pager and um, a camera a reminder of a time gone by and proof that no good deed really does go undone in some strange way karma seems to have come back around so what would the you 14 years from now think of what you carry around every day always stylish never goes out remember when we thought these were high tech and what is this in seabrook new hampshire julie lonchak wbz news